All right, everybody, Thomas with Virginia Outdoors Unlimited here today. Uh, today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to be doing some upland game hunting. Uh, prime, we're going to be targeting quail and woodcock today. And uh, I was lucky enough to be invited out here by Chase uh, to hunt with a couple of his buddies. Um, hunting over a dog, doing something I've never done before. Uh, I'm very excited for this. You know, I've always been, you know, I've done a little bit of grouse hunting, just kicking up grouse and trying to shoot them. But I never hunted over a dog in, for upland game before, uh, so I'm very, very excited for this. Um, I don't really know the type of environments we're going to be hunting, I'm pretty sure. Just some hardwoods, bottomlands, um, looking for the areas where those birds, birds are going to be hanging out. Uh, in terms of guns, today I'm going to be shooting something I've never shot before. I'm going to be shooting uh, my buddy Jack's uh, Browning A5 Sweet 16, so it's a 16 gauge A5. Uh, so that'll be something a little bit, a little wrinkle uh, that I'm going to be throwing in here trying to, you know, shoot some cool birds with an older gun. So we're going to be heading out here before too long, just waiting to meet up with the other guys and uh, get on some birds. Look at you, sweet little thing. Uh, Llewellyn is a type of English setter. This is a blue belt in Llewellyn, so the, the Llewellyn's a, uh, like a hybrid breed of all the time. But blue bones are only black and white. We want to hang out to the right. Come on. Come on, Jack. She'll, she'll come around. Ah. Alright. Okay, get ready. Alright. Uh. Oh yeah, she's on point. Good shot. What was that woodcock? Yeah. That was right here. Got that on camera. Yeah. I like to get a retrieve. That was you, wasn't it, Mason? That was a split. Dang, that is a wild looking bird. Looks like a snipe. Yeah. Guess he got hit pretty hard. <laughs> yeah. No, They're smaller than you would yeah, think I they are. That. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. He uh, really that, 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 that is a uh, cool bird. Very cool bird. I don't think I could have even got the gun up in time if I had. <laughs> well, I, knew I, was I had one shot while I was waiting for it to get up, but it never did. Mm -hmm. I couldn't even. God damn it. Bet she's on point, Bill. Okay. Yeah, for real. I think I got it. I, I got it. Should I just go pick it up? Yep. You shot a hair before I did. I don't think you got him. I had to wait for him to come right over my head. That should be pretty good footage.
They can't be easy to find. Here it is. So uh, the eyes are open. Right to your right. Oh, okay. Right there? Yep. Find it? Yep. Come here. Come here. There you go. Pretty one. There is my first ever woodcock. Headless woodcock. Where? What should I do with it? Just stick it. He got a. Uh, he has a pocket in his vest. If you want to put it in there. Throw the body and the head for a picture. I don't really need the head, but you can put it in there if you really want. To. We'll keep it for a, for the picture right. at the end. Thank right. you. She's back behind us. I think. I don't know. What it sounds like. Yeah. Hey, she's on point. There's a point. All right. She's right here. Hey, there's another point up yeah, there. she's straight in. Y'all coming in? Sounds like she's moving still now. Should I just keep going? Yeah, it's about to be easy. Make sure you see the dog first and we'll pointing. Yep. All right, she's pointed in here to the left. Okay. She's in here to the left. Okay. Oh. Which yeah, I think I killed it. Yeah, here goes those. Walking. If I did, we're gonna need weight, I think. Did go down? I didn't see it keep flying. I didn't see it go down. I really feel like I hit that bird, but I can't find it. I didn't get a good line. So I guess maybe we can take Ch or Wade back in there. I know the area. That was a tough shot. I was not expecting that bird to get up. At least you don't have any trees to eat your shot. Oh, yep. She's chasing it. It's moved to the right. There is another. Oh. Is that another? Seven or eight. That was a lot. I would say double digits. It might have been more. Yeah, we can walk in behind him. There might be a couple more. Dang. If they had let us get right up on top, that would have been. Nice little quail there. That's the first quail I've ever seen. Yeah. Virginia Quick, wild quail. Virginia wild quail. No pen raised birds. What was that, a hen? That's my dad. Cool bird. I'm not sure if I hit one. I didn't see I didn't see yours go down. I didn't see any. Alright, fella. I got one. Yeah. That was a good shot. Those birds were far. That's cool, man. Cool looking bird right there. They're 
bastards. They got some talons on them too. Yeah, yeah. yeah they did. Uh, they've drawn blood on me twice. <coughs> Those are some, some talons. Them. All right, everybody, so we have finished up our hunt now. Uh, ended out pretty well. We only hunted for probably about two hours. Uh, we just kind of worked all the land. The dog was tired. We were tired. We did a lot of walking. Uh, but we came away with two woodcocks and one quail. Uh, we only jumped three woodcocks all day. Um, we had the first two we jumped we killed, and then the third one, it kind of busted a little bit far, in, far out in front of me. I was the only one who got to it in time. And... Uh, I took a shot and really still not sure if I hit that bird or not. We could not find it for the life of us. So just going to assume that I missed that bird. Uh, in terms of quail, we only jumped one covey. It was a pretty sizable covey. Uh, I think probably in the double digit, probably in the low double digits. Uh, but we did not get a really good shot at them. They've jumped out kind of far in front of us too. Uh, we only dropped one of those birds and will drop that bird. So you know, not a bad day at all. I'm kind of hooked in terms of upland game hunting. I really enjoyed hunting over that dog. Uh, it was just, you know, so much fast action. You know, you, you know, you'd be standing around just chatting with your buddies, and then all of a sudden, you know, you had to rush to get to the birds uh, when the, when the dog was on point. But uh, I need to thank Chase. I need to thank Bill, uh, Mason, and Will for having me out there. Um, and it was a really fun experience, and I'm really hoping to be able to do more of it in the future. Uh, I want to speak a little bit more on the gun I was shooting today as well. I need to thank my buddy Jack for allowing me to borrow his uh, Browning A5 Sweet 16. Um, for those of you who don't know, that's just basically an A5 that is chambered in 16 gauge. Uh, they're kind of a rareish gun, a little bit of a valuable gun. And uh, I was, you know, I wanted to, you know, I figured it would be cool to shoot something a little bit older, something a little bit different. I've never shot a 16 gauge before. And, uh, it ended up being really cool, so I need to thank Jack for that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you guys aren't already subscribed to the channel and enjoy these uh, Upland Game Hunts, make sure to leave me a comment and tell me that you guys are um, enjoying these. Make sure to subscribe to the channel as well if you're not already. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching.